on September 7th, Nekakado Avocado shocked the world with a video titled Two Steps Ahead. The video showed how he lost 250 pounds and explained that he filmed two years worth of content and hid his journey from the world. He deemed it the largest social experiment of his life. Brakes! Now I feel I need to address this because I made a video about him seven months ago and I left this comment so that I actually predicted. First thing in this video, I was shocked as everyone else was. But it was a huge sigh of relief because it was a happy ending for now. <laughs> but whether you agree with his approach or not, it's absolutely fantastic that he dropped the weight and he showed the world what's possible. Whether or not the entire eight years were planned, where he started skinny, gained some weight, and then lost weight. It's possible he let himself go and may have had a bit of a health scare and then decided to turn his life around and devise a plan in order to turn it into a positive. I mean, that's the job of most content creators is to entertain, adapt and maintain attention. Now, of course, we're all left with questions and knowing Nick is a mastermind creator. I've absolutely no doubt in my mind that he filmed the entire journey, documenting himself losing all that weight and he's going to use it, which I believe is going to be fantastic because other people will be inspired and he can actually help people. Now, to address the comments on my video, people say my video aged like milk clearly didn't understand what I was trying to achieve. I was telling Nick's story, then offering him help and saying not all of us in the fitness industry are bad because my peers in the fitness industry use Nick as an example and as a punching bag. Now to address the comment that I left because people are talking about it. Do you think that Nick is putting on a show and this is all part of a big plan? Or do you think we are witnessing a radical downward spiral documented online? When doing my research, myself and my team watched countless videos of his and we noticed he's a smart guy. He knew a lot about nutrition. I'm gonna go have some pumpkin, which is high in potassium, but low in calories. Um, yeah, so I kind of want to share this little tip for you guys a lot of people don't eat sufficient amounts of potassium actually I think they say like 90% of Americans are not meeting their basic needs of potassium levels which is very important for your kidneys and your heart don't worry about eating too much there's fiber that regulates the potassium and people there's a lot of people that are afraid of eating, eating potassium if you don't cook them probably not because there's plant cellulose in them pumpkin is a great alternative I hope that Nick did see my video and that it may have changed his perception of the fitness industry because the vast majority of the world failed his social experiment. So Nick, you did leave a legacy as the guy who changed. But at the end of the day, I can't tell you what to do or not to do. But you have a lot of attention on you and you're your own person. But I really hope you do lead everyone by a positive example and that you leave that legacy in a good light.